Marlins taking on the Cardinals. Miami has won each of Henderson Alvarez's last nine starts. If they extend it to 10 on Sunday, that would be a new franchise record. Alvarez opposed by Marco Gonzalez on the hill for St. Louis. Top of the first, two outs and a runner on third, and Casey McGee delivers with a single into center. Christian Yelich scores. It's 1-0 Miami. That extends McGee's hit streak to 13 games. He's now reached base in 30 consecutive games. Bottom four, Alvarez in some trouble. Two outs and runners on the corners. He gets Oscar Tavares to ground into a force out at second, and he gets out of the inning unscathed. And bottom five with the runner on, he strikes out Matt Carpenter to end the frame. Marlins are looking for some more runs in the top of the sixth. Bases loaded and two outs for Marcelo Zuna facing Nick Greenwood. A bouncer into left field. That's a base hit. Alvarez will score. Yelich right behind him. And finally, the Marlins crack a hit in a big spot, and it's 3-0. Marlins would tack on one more in the inning to make it 4-0. Top seven, Alvarez doing it with the bat. He singles into right field, his third hit of the game. That's a career high for Alvarez, but the Marlins do not score in the frame. Bottom seven, Colton Wong activated off the DL, playing in his first game since June 20th. He hits his solo home run to right field, his second of the season. Cardinals are on the board. It's a 4-1 game. Miami up 5-1, top of the eighth. Jared Saltalamacchia facing Jason Mott with runners on the corners looking to put the game out of reach. Saltalamacchia, a high, high drive. Craig is back at the wall. Gone to the moon. What a high blast to right by Saltalamacchia. And Miami cracks it wide open. 8-1. Saltalamaki is ninth of the season. Marlins go on to win 8-4. Miami has now won Henderson Alvarez's last 10 starts. That's a new franchise record. Alvarez gets the W going 7, allowing one run on five hits while striking out three. Jeff Baker goes 2-4 for four and drives in two runs.